Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Fredericks by Meyer. These are potato chips. Uh, Fredericks by Meyer is a Meyer brand. These were $3.09 each a bag. It's kind of expensive, honestly. $3.09, and this is only an eight ounce bag. I think that's a little pricey, but you know, maybe all it's chips. It's their fancy chips. Uh, yeah. Uh, this is a crinkle kettle tandoori style barbecue. Yeah, I think they're all crinkle kettle. They are. Oh, okay. Um, hot cheddar and sweet pickled habanero. Okay, so we're going to try the tandoori style barbecue first. This is small batch crinkle kettle chips cut thick for a bold crunch with the flavors of tandoori style barbecue seasonings. It says skin mm -hmm. on. Um, I am not going to open these like they want you to. They have a place here and it says pull to open. We've done that before in videos when we've reviewed these Fredericks by Meyer. We don't like it. Yeah, because they give you an opening like this big to pour your chips out of. <laughs> or to stick your hand yeah. in. I have big hands. I have long fingers. I, I need a bigger space. So I'm going to, you know, We'll, are, we'll fold them over. Be a rabble and cut the bag. Yeah, it's just not a big enough space for us. So, it does not work for us. Okay, so, these are, it says there's eight servings in the container. One ounce, 28 grams, about 13 chips is 150 calories. And they're probably, all, I would think they would all be that way. Okay. Ooh, there's a giant fold over. These are the kettle chips that are just a little on the hard side. Mm -hmm. um, so texture-wise, they're a little hard. Oh. I just get more of a barbecue flavor than anything. Well, I did it first. I got the barbecue first. Um, and then there's a seasoning that comes in. Um, and I like it. And it's not too heavy. It's just a little bit of it. Um, I, I really, I actually really like them. Wonder if it's that turmeric. Um, I don't know, but it, it's not too heavy. It for the most part, it tastes like a barbecue potato chip. Yeah, it's kind of a sweet. It's sweet. It's yeah. not. It's not spicy. I think that spicy good though. Yeah, it's just a hint of it, and, and it's not off putting or anything. Mm. It's actually really nice, but. Um, I, my problem with it, honestly, is it's too hard. It's pretty hard. Um, it's really hard. So I like kettle chips. I like the the kettle brand of chips. Mm -hmm. um, these are very similar to the kettle brand of chips. These as are far as the hardness goes. Yeah, these are very just hard. Yeah. It's like why would you want it to be that hard? Because we do like some a lot of kettle yeah. chips. Yeah, though the kettle brand chips, the difference is they're a little thinner. They're they're the same hardness, but they're thinner, so they're they're a little easier to crunch through. These are kind of a thicker cut, mm -hmm. so um, so they seem even harder. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're they're good. The flavor's good though. Just um, yeah, you different. definitely get that. Uh, see, I wonder if it, it's the turmeric. I bit. like it though. It it doesn't add any it's heat. It's not overpowering. It's not overpowering. It goes nicely with the barbecue mm -hmm. flavor that it has. Yeah, I agree. I like so them. I could definitely eat those. Just yeah. know they're hard. Yeah, it wouldn't be my, my pick necessarily, but it would be they're good. These are the hot cheddar, and they are um, oh a kicked up with hot and spicy cheddar. They really didn't give you much of a. Uh, description on these. 150, 150 calories as well. Who this one's curled like a flower. There's plenty of fall over here. I know exactly what that tastes like. Exactly what that tastes like. And if you don't say it, if you don't agree, I'm gonna be shocked. Okay. The cheddar cheese in that, right when I popped it in my mouth, it's Cheeto. That cheese, he's not going to go with me on this. That cheese, the second I put it in my mouth, I thought, that's Cheeto cheese. No, I ate lots of Cheetos. This one got Cheeto cheese. It's too um, acidic. They got too much acidity in there. Like a vinegar almost. Yeah, there is a vinegar in there. But. I don't get the taste of anything resembling a Cheeto. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. No, that's okay. I do think I do think the cheese part of it, mm. not the heat part of it. Yeah. 
I think the cheese very, very, very much reminds me when you get a bag of Cheetos and you get one of them that's really coated with the thick cheese, because they're not all that, I mean, they're pretty well coated, but some of them have a thicker coating than others. That reminds me of a thick coating of Cheeto cheese. And you're just- Not me at all. It's okay. Everybody so what did you think? They're good. I mostly get like a, a hot sauce kind of like a, like it does taste a little bit like a cheese, but it's more of a, like the funky cheese, like the hard cheeses. Um, and then, I know. <laughs> and, um, and the heat comes through as like a vinegary hot sauce kind of flavor. It's, not strong. It's not like vinegar. It's not like that, but you get the little tang in there. Uh, I can agree with you about the hot part of it. Um, it's just where you just differ about that cheese. Because yeah, I, I don't think it's funky at all. It's not like um, funky bad. It's just one of those hard cheeses that's a little strong. Yeah. We're, uh, so d would you eat those? Do you like them? No. <laughs> See, I like them. I did not get funky cheese. The hot part of it is not like you're kind of scaring people off from buying the bag wow. because it says hot. I mean, they have a little tingle in the back of your throat. But it's not, not I mean, that's nothing. That's yeah. mild. That's a mild sauce. No. That is not hot at all. No. Maybe when you get down to the powder at the bottom of the bag or something, it's going to be hotter. Mm -hmm. It is not hot. Um, like I said, there is some tingle in the back of your throat, though. So don't think they're not hot at all. They are a little hot, but not, not what they're making. Them like. These are the sweet pickled habanero. No, they should be in these should be hot. You would think so. Okay. Ooh, they uh, suck it. Fiery habanero flavor and a dash of turmeric. Same calories. Wow. These strong, they have a strong smell. Yeah. Mm. That pickle flavor is almost like a sweet pickle flavor. Or the pickles you get on, I mean, those little pickled uh, peppers you get on top of like a Hoppa John's pizza. Mm -hmm. Have that kind of vinegary flavor. Mm -hmm. It's almost a sweet uh, pickle though. That's interesting. Does it say sweet? It does say sweet in it. Yeah. It says That's sweet. Why. Okay, so they've taken a habanero and they pickled it in, in the sweet pickling juice instead of the dill pickle juice. So it's not as vinegary, it's more sweet. So it's like a sweet pickle, but it's a cucumber cheese and jalapeno. I like them. They're different. But it's supposed to be fiery. They're a little hot. Mm -mm. They're not that hot. The first one that I put in my mouth, I, um, I didn't know if I was going to like the flavor of that turmeric. Um, I, um, I don't mind it. Mm -mm. I don't mind it at all. i tell you what the difference between the hot cheddar and that one is though. The hot cheddar where I did get the tingle was all in the back of my throat. Whereas these are more of an even heat on my whole tongue. Mm -hmm. So it's more spread out. Mm -hmm. It's not any more intense necessarily, but it is more spread out. I think it lasts a little bit longer too. I actually really like them. Mm -hmm. um, I haven't had sweet pickle in years, but that's what they taste like. I think you need to give them a chance. Don't buy it and just eat one. Eat more than one because it's a really nice heat. Mm -hmm. um, it for me, it's not fiery, but it, it gives you the, to me. It gives me a nice, pleasant tingle throughout mm -hmm. my entire mouth, like yeah. all over. Oh, it's definitely not fiery. It's, no, it's just, it is it, not. Fiery. It is a tingle though. Um, and I do love the flavor of the the pickle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's yeah. nice. It has a very nice. Um, Those it, little sweet pickles. It is. Yes, it's of. sweet. But then you do get the heat from the habanero. You do get the little bit of turmeric, but really it, it only affects you that first bite. And then after that, you're used to it. And it, it's really nice. It's a, one of those that, um, and they're nice and greasy. And I know people probably think that's a bad yeah. thing. <laughs> when I say that, I mean it as a good thing. I don't think these do not come across as hard as the first ones we had, the tandoori. They don't seem as hard because they seem like they're a little bit greasier to me these uh the habanero and i really like them i think that i like those the best of the three mm. the, the habanero i do too i was trying the cheddar again just to see if i got that flavor you you i still don't get the cheeto color. it's okay i get the cheese <laughs> but it's not a, a cheddar I it's not a say, cheeto color. kevin eats 
a lot of Cheetos. I never eat Cheetos, but I do think Cheetos have that very distinct flavor. It's one of those things where once you've had Cheetos, you know the flavor. And it's like, oh, that comes back to me. So I don't think you have to eat a lot of Cheetos to appreciate it, but we, we just have a difference of opinion on that one. So which one are you choosing out of the three? The, the pickle one. That's so funny because had I been a betting person, which, you know, I am kind of, um, I would never have thought I would have picked those. I would have probably thought I would have picked the hot cheddar or something uh -huh. like that. Uh, but it's the habanero. It's it's not fiery. They're see they're putting words that are gonna send fear into people. Well, hot, but if fiery. you don't like hot food though, you won't like those. Like the hot cheddar, I ate like three or four more of those. They are hotter on the back of your tongue. But they're not flaming hot. None of these are. I they're mean, not, even I mean, even grip are hotter than these. Yeah. So so yeah, it's it's not too hot. I just think they're scaring half their audience by putting those words mm -hmm. on the bag, and and really they didn't need to put those. No, words they're on the bag. spicy. They are a little heat, but. Yeah, these would be what I would consider like medium, maybe. Yeah, and Meyer, if you have a Meyer and you haven't looked at their chips, listen. Tons. That's the biggest aisles of chip aisles. They, yeah, but these specifically, mm -hmm. Frederick's by Tons. Meyer, they have so many. Well, we've reviewed a bunch on the mm -hmm. channel, but even though we've reviewed these and the ones we have reviewed, there's still tons that we haven't even no. tried. So they just have a lot to choose from. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.